In this RHC technical video, we'll demonstrate application of AST800 Acrylic Wet Set ESD Adhesive when installed in conjunction with ESD tile and a copper grounding strap. Using this ESD flooring system, ASD800 dissipates unwanted static electricity buildup to ground. Always refer to the flooring and adhesive product data sheets for detailed instructions when selecting approved adhesives. ASD800 is an acrylic wet set ESD adhesive designed for installation of ESD vinyl and rubber flooring materials. It's water-based, low VOC, and solvent-free, and is recommended for installations on porous substrates only. Over porous substrates only, apply the adhesive with a 1 16th by 1 16th by 1 16th V-notch trowel, sometimes referred to as a flat V. With this ESD system, the copper grounding strap can be set into the system at a predetermined location. Whether it's at a known point of grounding, a grounding bar, or through an outlet, this should be determined by an electrician and not the flooring contractor. It's required to have a minimum of 9 inches of copper material embedded into and covered with the adhesive, and another 9 inches exposed for the electrician to make the appropriate connections. Once the initial layer of adhesive is spread, install the copper strap into the adhesive and then apply additional adhesive over the top of the copper strap and make sure it's embedded before installing the tile. Remember that one strap for every 2,000 square feet is required in large rooms or one strap for every room if they are individual rooms. Install your flooring tiles into the wet adhesive. When using ASD 800, work off the material. When working off of material is not possible, use a kneeling board or equivalent to disperse weight evenly and prevent adhesive displacement. Make sure you're getting good transfer onto the flooring product. After flooring installation, roll with a 100-pound floor roller in both directions. Once the flooring installation is complete and there has been adequate dry time, an electrician can make the appropriate connections to the copper grounding strap.